At this time of the day, the porcelain factory in my hometown has started the morning shifts. <laughs> I wonder how it is doing now. Feels like I was there yesterday. These are not my hands, but if you want to feel them, you can try touching the electric current. Sorry. <laughs> Just a minute. I'll find another place for these costumes right now.
What to watch now? The Fitness Girl. Where on earth do these seeds come from? They are stuck in the crevices. Can't even get them out with the gravity vacuum cleaner. It's like they are rooted. They weren't here until a few days ago. I heard some of these seeds were also found in the rehab center. But the staff there got rid of them in no time. Bloody hell. Looks like we have to dig them out one by one with our fingers. Gotta get it done before the inspector's here. Seed? What seed? Hmm, let me take a look. Oh, I can't see anything. I'm so bored. I really have to sign the agreement to get out. But I haven't discussed it with anyone yet. A fair lady always thinks it through and reaches an agreement with the adults before she signs any document. Mr. Carson has said that hundreds of times. It must be vital. Oh. Backup! We need backup! Emergency! The whole forest appeared in room 101, the material area. It's... it's growing out of Timekeeper's suitcase. What are you talking about? As I said, it's an emergency. The staff in room 102 and 103 are here to help. A large number of branches came out of the suitcase. They can detect our positions and even attack us on their own. Did you use Draco Trout? of inflammables. The whole floor would be burning now if we did. We used military chainsaws, but it's a drop in the bucket. Fine, I'll go apply for a few more. Just wait for me there. Egerton, go help them out. Run to that. A forest is growing out of Miss Virgin's suitcase. Could it be? It's true, this is Great Arcane Spill. Gods are gone. Oh, I wish I could see that bizarre scene myself. Huh? What's that strange sound? Such a slender 
branch actually broke the lock. How marvelous! You are Miss Sotheby's hero! Hey! How did you get out? Just one thing. I will be home by 10 p.m. Anyone else? Is she here?
for everyone. Here are 30 cans of Dr. Pepper, 20 bags of Happy Wedges, 11 bags of Bigfoot Gummy, and a bottle of insect repellent for plants. Oh, good timing. There may be a bit of ash on them, but the flavor and texture should still be fine. Way more than a bit. I can't just carry them with me in broad daylight. Do you know how many procedures I've gone through just to pay you a visit? But how come you're locked in the same room? Since when has the Foundation become so benevolent? They would like Captain to guide me to the right path, to join the Foundation. After all, Captain was already a member of them. 
but I don't feel any difference in the benefits I get. At best, I could contact someone from the outside. And you're here. So, Texas Hold'em? That's not what I'm here for. I've shown you the storm records these years. So, did you find anything? Hmm. You call it a record, but it's so brief that it only has start time and duration. I can't tell any pattern from that. Hmm. This apple believes that the storm, which happens randomly, does not conform to the self-adjusting nature of the universe. Self-adjusting? Hmm. Oh. Is that the theory you mentioned before? Something like, there should be someone who intervenes or improves the system in order to reduce the growth of the instability of the universe? For example, if the universe is a mooring rope, no, a bunch of ropes, there has to be a sailor who pulls the ropes to keep them in order or something. Sounds like the cosmology from centuries ago. But your metaphor reminds me of Madame Z's research on string theory. She advocates that the energy string is the most basic unit of the universe. Are you talking about Vertin's boss? Boss? Well, if that's your definition of immediate supervisor, then yes. Madame Z was a scientist who studied in Britain before she joined the Foundation. Red and honey are the staff of life. That makes sense. Well, it's not a good choice for most scientists. Recently, she has been promoted from the chief of the vice president's staff to a formal member of the committee. I guess she will spend even less time in the lab. Ugh. The whole building shakes. Could something hit it? Let me see. Is that Druvis and Sotheby? What's this? Guys? I am not going to be dragged into a ride at this point. <gasps> Is that Druvis? What happened to her? Her new hairstyle is sort of cool. Captain, it's not the point. Agreed. Not the point at all. I gotta go. If you want me to take part in such an event, my name should never be in the visitor log. Looks like the whole building will be your battlefield. All right, good luck. Wait a minute. If we joined Druvis, what would happen? <laughs> what would happen? I'm not a prophet. But this is going to be the best spot for protest. This building is the furthest one from the center of the Foundation. On the first and second floors are material rooms and research offices. Few staff stay here. The room next to yours is the projection lab. It was used to control the slides projected in the lobby. That screen is gone now, but the transfer devices and circuits are still there. You know what? If you're going to protest, make it loud. It's been a long time since the Foundation had something this much fun. Mr. Druvis, it's Bert 
imagine having a fight with the Foundation? Yes. We have a disagreement with the Foundation, Miss Sotheby. Burton is seeking a limited freedom for us. Her aspiration is to restore the peaceful life before the storm. For the authorities, however, her aspiration and ambition are labeled as deviation and rebellion. We are thus tempted, alienated, and arrested unjustly. That's why we've been grounded all these days. So we're helping Burton now. Is that right, Miss Jubis? I really feel like doing something for her. Just like what I'm doing right now, standing brave on the tree. Right, on the tree. We need to move forward, to move one step further. When we meet up with Regulus and Apple, our voices will be stronger, and more and more people will offer their help. I believe that when the day comes, we will be able to shake up the balance in the Foundation and tilt it to our side. Shake up the balance? Wow! Maybe Vashon will come back herself by then! I got it! Now my goal is to make more potions so the trees can grow larger and larger! Make them super large! This is going to be a protracted war of resistance. After we rescue Regulus, please maintain our territory of the woods with the rest of your potions, Miss Sotheby. Sure, I will economize on them. Look, X is coming out of the room. He left. It seems he has made his choice. Not helping us or them. Well, at least no one is getting hurt from the boiling pot this time. Let me see. Hmm, there are more guards at the door now. It seems everyone's there. Perhaps they have guessed our next move. Regulus. Let's go. It's time to meet up with our companions. Go, go! Regulus must be bored to death just as I was. Crime group. Hm. Just to my likings. All right. Just one thing. I will be home by 10 p.m. I don't like to resort to violence. Sadly, but these are accidents. Happen. Sadly, these are counters. Damn it, 
What's in my clothes? It's been a break. It's been a break. Intriguing, isn't it? Of service, my lady, just as I will. Just like real diamonds. Time to wake up, gentlemen. and Dazzle can easily confuse one's vision. I'm sorry for you. Your fate is doomed! Thank my water. Watch my clothes. <laughs> Intriguing, isn't it? Service, my lady. Made it to your mind? Sadly, these are counterfeits. Just as I would. You don't drink this every day. Service, my lady. Made it to your mind. Time to wake up, gentlemen. Sadly, these are counterfeits. You don't drink this every day. Fragrance and dazzle can easily confuse one's vision. I'm sorry for you. Service, my lady. Fine. Sadly, these are counterfeits. <gasps> oh, you deserve it. I don't have to do it. Made it to your mind? Intriguing, isn't it? <gasps> Thank my water. 
just as I will. Service, my lady. Your fate is doomed. Just as I will. Fine. Time to wake up, gentlemen. I know how to do it. Thank my water. Fragrance and dazzle can easily confuse one's vision. I'm sorry. Pride goes before the fall. I've been there. You better take it. Do we have the candidate's name list? Show it to me. Yes. Please wait a minute. It'll be prepared right away. Um, why is the light on? After that, we are... Madam, I... I didn't. I... What's the matter? Something wrong with the printer? No, no. Oh, right. Uh, the candidate name list. Here you are. Thank you. This is exactly what I need. Sorry for the scene. Like others here, they also have the right to make their voices heard. It is the essential step for us to come to an agreement. We will take care of this, don't worry. However, perhaps we should stop using the old projector. It may lead to accidents, don't you think? Understood. I'll remove the transfer devices now. Oh, bloody hell! How dare they cut off the power? This pirate has so much left to declare. Wimps, cowards, hypocrites. Hear, hear. I can't agree more. It is very rude to hang up before others finish their words. This is not telephone, Miss Sotheby. But of course, that's not the point. No matter what, we've communicated to them the most crucial requirements for negotiation. I'm sure they will respond to us properly. I just want to take the chance to show our attitude. Taking over the radio station at the headquarters of the Foundation, it's a gas in the late hundreds of years. Ah, oh, the 
It would have been perfect if we could have another you can't win to close it out. We could look around here to see if there's other broadcasting equipment. However, this apple does not recommend frequent provocation. Right now, it's more important to patrol the surroundings in case we are ambushed by the guards. Miss Druvis is forming abatis alone downstairs. Perhaps she needs our help. Mm, fine, you have a point. This pirate has decided to put off the plan to liberate the foundation. Besides forming abatis, what else do we need to do? There's much to be done, Captain. Find water sources, transfer essential equipment, reserve enough food, set up multiple defenses in the woods, and arrange a duty schedule. Make sure someone is garrisoned outside the suitcase while others are resting inside. Well, I have the tomato and potato seeds from Ms. Druvis. We must plant them in the suitcase to guarantee food supply. Um, tomato and potato? All vegetables, no meat? Oh, they're meant for the piggies that grow my bacon. When I was wandering the seas, at least I could have a grilled sea bass every day. I wonder what Vertin eats in rehab. Will she be hungry? <gasps> Almost forgot about the goodies accent. We'll definitely hang in there for a few more days with them. Sotheby, Mr. Apple, you go downstairs first. I'll meet up with you once I bring the box down there. All right. We will meet you at the entrance. Stay safe. Resort to violence, but accidents happen. just like real dialogue. Made it to your mind. Handle it gently. Time to wake up, gentlemen. Sadly, these are counterfeits. The ocean dried and I'm alone again. <laughs> Fragrance and dazzle can easily confuse one's vision. I'm sorry for you. Glad to be of service, my lady. Handle it gently. Mm, a little bit hot here. 
just like real diamonds. My child, here's something fun for you. Damn it. Watch my clothes. Damn it. Intriguing, isn't it? Take it easy. Just like real diamonds. Try for free. Try for free. Glad to be of service, my lady. Handle it gently. Hilarious! Just as I will. My child, here's something fun for you. How dare you! Intriguing, isn't it? I hear your wish! Take it easy. Just as I will. The Trials of the Wise Wizards for sure! There is no need to hold an emergency meeting for this. Such declaration of war without tactic or plan B is typical example of Arcanist's behavior. The area they controlled has no value at all, no matter in terms of the size or the influence. Well, the administration department has not taken official actions yet. I heard the plan was to dispatch a team to escort them to the School of Discipline. Problem solved, then. Next time, if Verdin brings back more unregistered arcanists, will the same thing happen again? I don't understand. It's not a shame to join the Foundation, is it? By signing the agreement, Arcanists will enjoy the right to use arcane skills in human society and be bestowed great honor. The Human Resource Department could have used the whole floor to hold the applications a dozen years ago. Not even the New Age movement could challenge the Foundation's authority in the international community. And these short-sighted exceptions, they aren't even worth being made a topic for the meeting. Yet, they are not here for the Sympathal Foundation. They are here for Verton. They choose to follow her out of their own will, because of their admiration for her. That is the essential difference between them and our former recruits. You mean, it's not important at all for them to join the Foundation? I'm afraid so. But we can't expel them. We both know that the Foundation now requires new members to form a stronger force. <laughs> what are you trying to say, Missy? E? Skip to the point.
Today, the House of Integrators has resubmitted a revised draft of storm reformation, manpower and discipline. I think it's time to decide if this draft can be adopted and then start a debate. You are asking for troubles, madam. Please turn to page 21, section 3. External personnel recruited by the timekeeper should be placed within the timekeeper's department. The timekeeper has the duties of education and discipline to them and should be responsible for their follow-up behaviors. Personnel within the timekeeper's department, subject to the foundation staff code, will take orders from the timekeeper and are not required to take direct orders from the foundation. This section allows those unregistered arcanists to have more autonomy and develop a stronger sense of identity as a part of the foundation. Meanwhile, by giving orders to the timekeeper, the foundation still has the military right to deploy them. It can solve the current problem. Which means we will be working with some uncontrollable mercenaries. I'll say it's the reserve service for wartime. It's not going to work. What happened when the Arcanists were not under control? Massacres, tyranny, endless revenge. History is nothing but a sword to them, where they vent their excessive energy and deceive those in power with a speech of ignorance. The reality has proven that. Exactly. What's more, there has never been a reform as such in the history of the Foundation. During the unexpected storm, reforming in a rush will only increase the... Re <laughs> Sorry for being late. Quite a heated discussion. I can see you all have a great interest in this draft proposal. Hope I didn't miss too much. Let us get to know each other. begin 
Dogs with a better dog. He did this first. sun as the apple drops to the ground. The eagle's eyes. Fine. <laughs> Target locked. For the day keeps the doctor away. It's time to say goodbye. Don't miss me, really. I'll be back.
This place is not as interesting as you thought it would be. People have locked away many things. Locks over locks. my hands but if you want to feel them you can try touching the electric current what is going wrong turn it off and on again or unplug the tv don't you know a restart so everything <laughs> 